So these are the underwear from, I think the website is called Hips and Curves. If, if I mess that up, I will post their URL underneath. But uh, very nice. Look who's here checking out the underwear as well, my sidekick. But um, I'll put them on and depending um, how much I can make not a bunch of my skin show up, I might show you. So first I want you to remember that I've had a lot of surgery on my stomach. Uh, a lot. Like way more than anybody should ever have had to have. So my stomach looks like a war zone. My son says it looks like what? Pudding? I'm, yeah, pudding stirred seriously. Stirred pudding. Furiously stirred pudding. But these underwear are adorable and even though they didn't say that they were boy shorts, that's what I, the way that they looked on the model. I love boy shorts. So, here goes again. Oh, another warning. I only have one belly button, but it actually looks like I have three because of all my surgeries. And, well, you'll see. So, don't give me any grief, you know? When you're dying and they open you up to try to save your life, they're not worried about making you look beautiful. They're worried about making you survive. So here we here we go. I, were boy, you know. <laughs> I don't even care. But there. I love this here. I got a little bit of a tummy there, but I'm really happy. There's some of the belly button action here. Actually my real belly button is here. And these some here that look like belly buttons over here, but they're just for surgeries. Anyway, so pretty nice they have that boy shorty kind of look and that's what I like and I don't want to show you the back because they're really see-through and you'll be seeing some crackers but they do the same in the back they they actually cup under your butt cheek which is really what I like. I don't like a pair of underwear that is always riding up my can. That's so uncomfortable. Who wants to live like that? Thanks. So, my son says he does. Anyway, I'm going to wear these today, obviously. And if they ride me like a horse, I'll let you know. And if they're comfortable and I love them, I'll let you know too. But, yeah. I got bras from them too. And, uh, I'll, I'll take you out. I'll show you the bras. I'm not going to show you them on me. <coughs> so, this bag is adorable, isn't it? Uh, I got this the other day. I'll have to do a video about it. But these, I think the place is called Hips and Curves. Let's see if it's on here. No. It is a curvy girl website. I'll have to get it. I definitely will put it in there. And this is like for traveling to put your bras and your intimates in. And there is its big sister is on its way. Uh, I can't wait till it gets here so I can show you. But um, I'll do a separate video about that, this um, travel bag, so you can really get to know it. But I love it. I love the colors and it's a great idea because if you pack your stuff in, st in bags like this you just take the, out the baggies and put them in the drawers at the hotel making it so much easier so anyway uh oh these underwear are so comfortable i'm in love already and i have only walked about five feet but normally my underwear are riding up my butt crack so bad and i am constantly pulling out a wedgie and my son is always yelling from across the room wedgie because he can see that my underwear and my pants have been sucked into my crack i hate that it's very uncomfortable i think that men make these underwear to torture us that's what i think i think they're like let's make some underwear that are going to really piss this, this this these women off because they ride man i mean they ride me hard and i don't like it so anyway so far these haven't risen and they don't have any like you know how your bras can have that little piece of um 
kind of like a rubbery-ish strip on it so it doesn't slip. It doesn't have that, but they're not slipping. I only bought one pair because I wanted to see if I like them. All the time I will buy like a crap load from the store and I hate them. I've got so many underwear in a drawer in my bathroom. I don't even wear them because they suck. They suck hard. They look so nice on the package and then you get them home and you put them on and they don't cover your bum. You got half your butt crack, buck cheeks hanging out. I hate it. The only thing I don't like about these underwear is that they're totally see-through and I like to walk around in just a shirt and underwear and so I have a teenage son and I definitely can't be walking around with see-through underwear on in front of my teenage son that's just not cool so I have to I have some shorts some um, they're like a pajama short that are tiny and I'll just have to wear them when I wear these underwear but I'm definitely gonna order right now they have a special like three for something um, I'm gonna have to go back over there and get some but again I ordered one because I didn't want to go like oh they're so beautiful and buy a bunch and then I hate them because shipping things back is pretty expensive. So now that I've tried them on, I have to look at the size. I think I ordered one size up um, for my normal size. And they do feel a little bit big, but I actually kind of like it. Um, usually my underwear are tighter, but um, I ordered these a little bit bigger so they would cover my butt cheeks better. And, and I think I like it. That doesn't mean that you have to order one size up. I just did it because I want butt cheek coverage. I want the underwear to cup under my butt cheek and stay there. That's what I like. I don't like when the underwear have like a quarter, like angry eyebrows. That's where your underwear are. Eh, eh, they got ang angry eyebrows. I don't like angry eyebrow underwear. I want them cupping my butt cheek like they love me cup cup okay I will put the name of this website underneath I think it's called hips and curves or curves and hips and I just happened to see it someplace online I was like eh, I'll go check it out and uh, I'm glad I did the bras were two for 42 and they're actually a decent quality bra for four, two of them those are convertible bras where you can wear straps or not I just take the straps off. I don't wear the straps. This way there's no straps sliding down. So usually the convertible bras are even more expensive, but these on sale for two for 42. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, I gotta go. There's family over up, upstairs at my, my, I live in an apartment and my parents live upstairs. So um, I, there's family upstairs, so I've got to get my butt in gear. Yes, gear! I promised myself I wouldn't say gear. I love gear. Yes. Anyway, hope you have a good one. Look who's here. What were you doing? Hmm? He just had a bath. You look handsome from your bath, mister. Are you all nice and dry? I have to make a video of me blow drying him in the bathroom after he is so Cujo over the blow dryer. I don't know why, but he, I put, I put towels on the floor and he rolls around on them and scratches and rolls and dries himself off really well, but he also sounds like a violent canid. He is growling and barking as he's doing it. Uh, I don't know why he does that, but he really sounds vicious. Then when I'm blow drying him, it's the same thing. He is growling, his teeth are... <laughs> And I'm really careful not to get his face. Yeah, like I stay away from his face so the air is not blowing in his face. But he is like growling and barking like there's a mass murderer at the door. I don't know why he does that, but it makes me giggle just a little. He's on my pillow behind my pillows. This is my life. Hi, Boppers. What are you doing? Hey, are you ignoring me? Look at that lip. How'd you get to be this handsome? 
I don't know, it just happened one day. I poked out and there I am, so handsome. You're a good boy. I love you. <gasps> oh, thank Oh, too many kisses. Don't kiss me too much. Don't kiss me so much. You oh, thank you, thank you. Oh, ow. That's not kisses. That's digging a hole in my brain. Ow, 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 ow. Why are you hurting me? Ow, ow. This video took a turn for the craziness. What? <laughs> this is what he does to me. What? Are you okay? Do you want to go see somebody like Grandma and Pop? I know you do. I have to finish getting dressed and then we'll go see them. Okay? Say goodbye. Bye. Got to go now. Bye.